Hi guys, it's me, Kiki. Today we're gonna do... Uh, da -da -da! Reborn Nursery Tour. So, let's get into here. This is my Reborn Nursery. And also her sister's in here. She's uh, a regular baby doll. So why don't you guys come on in? This is Julia's little bed. Um, if you don't know who Julia is and you're new to my channel, I'll get her and put her on her bed. This is her bed. And um, this is Julia. Sorry, her hair is staticky. And um, she's wearing her pajamas because she is sick. So, um, yeah. There's a passy here, all her little knickknacks. <laughs> so, as you come in or walk in, she has her toilet right here. Um, I have to clean it out if they, because there's water in there. Um, pee, actually. Um, this is where I have all of bibs, bibs, things like that. This is a new bib. This is an old bib, and yeah. This is where I keep all of the books in here. It's nighttime stories, really if they just want to hear something. I keep random little thing, keychain hooks in here. I have a little surprise pets in here. Um, I keep markers in here. So it's basically a little stack of creativity. Um, don't mind all this mess behind the horse. Um, this is Julia's little rocking horse that she loves. I mean, loves it. Um, this is my little baby. This is Julia's little sister, actually. Um, her name is Lucy. She's very young. Um, uh, this is where she kind of sleeps. It's around here, and I like it because my workspace is right there, and I'll show you that in a minute, but let's continue on to her bed. So this is just where she sleeps. She doesn't really sleep underneath the blanket. Oh, sorry, her baby. Okay. I don't like her toes, her feet, so that's why I put these on, because her feet are ugly. <laughs> anyway, this is a pack and play. I have another toy, but I took Julia out today, and it's in the diaper in in one of her diaper bags. So yeah, she has this toy which Julia loves, and then this toy that she likes to stack with and roll, and it helps her practice her numbers. This little spot is just like a hangout spot for the girls to just hang out, lay down if they want to. Sometimes they both have a nap in here. Um, okay, moving on. This is my work slash studio space, my phone. So these are my credit cards, my phone case, where I can keep my phone. Um, I have thermometers, I have the, this helps her bangs. It, I use a toothbrush for her bangs. And also I use them to brush her teeth, obviously. Um, Julia has her ears pierced. Don't mind of everything else or the hair. Um, it's creepy. Um, but yeah, she has some earrings in here and things like that. Because she loves to wear these. And these are her favorite earrings. She threw out the rest of them because they were getting dirty. Um, these, this is a card that I just got, and I'm just keeping it there <laughs> for realism. This is, um, art supplies. So, I use this for food and things, um, like colored food and things like that. I have colored pencil in case the babies want to draw because they can't use these markers. You know, they are Crayola, which are washable. Um, I just don't like them because 
because <laughs> I'm, I'm just like, they'll get it everywhere. So, um, down here, we have a lot of things. Here's another pacifier. This is a pacifier. Um, it's a really cute pacifier. But sadly, it's trimmed all the way over here. So, yeah. I might put a magnetic in it because she can take magnetics, um, passies, but, um, who knows? I, it's just kind of down here, so I use it as decoration. And then this is a passy clip that I use for Julia because the younger baby doesn't really use it. Um, Julia's little sister, Lucy, doesn't use it. Um, so, because she never really needs it. Because at night, um, Lucy, 10, we'll get, we'll, 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 we'll talk about this after. Cool, I found a dye. Yeah. Keep this over there. there. Um, this is where I keep the diapers. This extra passies. And this one's not showed down. Um. I keep Julia's shoes in here, lots of diapers, as you guys can see, and pretty much, yeah, that's it. Um, down here, well, over here, I keep, this is where I make the food, I plan it out, and then downstairs in the kitchen, um, I tend to make food that's like real food, but then I make markers foods up here. And, yeah, like oatmeal, things like that, I do downstairs because it would kind of tend to get a little bit more messy. Anyway, this is where I'm my mixer. Um, I don't know what this is. I do know what that is. Um, this is a storage, a few storage bins. I have this extra spoon, and I actually have to do uh, some dishes. Paper towel rolls, so I have a nice face. And then down here, I keep all the bottles and things like that. I don't have a lot of bottles down here, though. So, yeah. Um, as we go through here, um, we're going to talk a little bit more about Lucy. So, um, like I said, with Lucy, um, she tends to spit out her past fires in the middle of the night. Uh, I have this toy that she plays with all the time, and she just loves it, and it has a this little hoop on it, so she kind of plays around with it. Um, and this is also good, but she's just not ready to use the pacifier clips because, like I said, she is a little... At nighttime, she spits out her pacifiers. Like... Yeah, she spits out her pacifiers, and um, she starts crying with her pacifier, so it doesn't really, ne it's not necessary for her to have her pacifier on while she's sleeping, and when she cries, because she just cries over the pacifier, so, yeah. Um, now we're going to talk about Julia a little bit. Julia is a very, 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 very special baby. Um, she's one of a kind. Um, I love her. I love that she always has a smile on her face, no matter what. Um, her bangs need fixing, though, I will say. Um, I need a toothbrush. So, she, um, she's very special, although she is very, very, very heavy. She, they made her to make her feel like a real baby. I think she's like five pounds, maybe. And I'll tell you guys some cool elements about her. So I'm going to put her kind of close up to the camera. So, this is Julia. Sorry, my dad's sneezing. Uh, so this, her very special eyes. Um, her eyes are actually made out of glass. So they're very delicate. Her eyelashes are rooted. Um, same on the other eye. 
painted on eyebrows, mo hair, that's why it gets all frizzy all the time. Not all the time, just tends to. And then her lips, beautiful lips, and her little teeth. Um, this is my first reborn, actually. Um, and we're planning to grow. Um, these are her very precious fingers. Little nails. I just love them. She's such a precious baby. Same as my little Lucy girl. Hello. Hello. She doesn't really talk, but she gags. She's cute. Um, so this is Lucy. And that is... Oh! And Lucy and Lucille might sound the same, so, um, might be kind of similar, because Lucy, Lucille Baby Live and her, um, her little sister, um, Julia's little sister, so, um, that's just one way to remember their names, because Lucille, Lucy, you know, baby life. So, I actually, when I was, when I actually got Julia, um, I think that was a year ago, was it, Daddy? Okay, okay, a year ago. Um, yeah, so I got her a year ago. Um, I made these paintings for her, I can read them to you. She actually did this one with me when she first came here very cute i did she did the little um bunny eyes i did the ears and she did the belly and the tail and the feet um and i did the butterfly she did the flower um love you i did i did this one before she was even here i looked up online to see how to draw a monster because i didn't know how to draw one so yeah and then i did this and then I eat ice cream, feel on 100%, fly high, so yeah, it's it, it kind of makes the room go pop, I don't know what theme I'm going to do yet, I think I might, I'm, I, I might do like a nature forest theme, um, but yeah, anyway, she is very happy, both of them are very happy, and they love this nursery, I can tell you that. Um, oh, but I forgot. She said one thing. Julia's clothes drawer. So, Julia is the size of 12 to 18 months, and only sometimes she can do 21 months to 22 months. But she's mostly 12 to 18 months. Some of the 12 to 18, 18 months don't really fit her too well. Because they're either too tight or too loose. But normally they're too tight. So we might have to go a little bigger. Um, she has her pajamas in here. Onesies. Shirts in here. Um, summer clothes. Such as like lots of shorts. Skirts. Um, dresses and tutus. Things like that. And jumpers she has a jacket here some colder weather stuff things that might make her feel warm and she looks so cute in this hat um, she has all of her things to put her hair back we have four of them and then she has her socks in the back she has way more um, you just can't see them and then she has her underwear so, yeah. We have a lot of space left. Oh, and then her, new, her shoes. These are the only shoes she has. Because the other one, I lost one of the pair. Oh. And if you research this doll online, um, my doll that I got, um, she might come with the little buckled shoes. But actually, I took them out. Um, the buckles are actually in this van. I just have them there for some reason. And now they're like little slide-on shoes, but they're really cool. I love the material because it's like rubber almost, so it's really easy for them. And I don't know what size this shoe is. I'm guessing. What is What size does this look, Daddy? I'm asking him. He can tell us. I think she's about three or four. Three or four. That's what I was going to say. Like four. <laughs> um, so, yeah. These really cute shoes. 
And um, this is an outfit since she's smaller. This is her outfit. She only has one outfit, which is sad, but um, she can deal with it. And she just literally looks cute in that outfit. So, um, yeah, and sometimes, like, Lucille's dresses, things are a little short, but I put some shorts underneath them. So, yeah. Right now they're in their PJs, and I'll see you on the next episode. I hope you enjoy, and if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. And what was I going to say? Like and subscribe, and don't forget to hit the bell and comments down below. Thanks. Au revoir.